So I just uh, videotaped this before it disappears. You know, usually it does, so you have it, you know. So I was staying in the village in Lake Giuria in Italy and we passed, I passed with my kids and, and my wife in the car. And we saw what happened that they got arrested, you know. And it was just, it was all over the Italian news. And we never knew what happened until I asked my uh, it my Italian friend, the colonel of the of the Italian army, and his carabinieri friends. So <laughs> we just saw it happen. So here it is. Some old church in Valençon. Everywhere in France now, you can see big flags hanging out. So that means they're ready to kill the Muslims. You know, bastards. They believe the, uh, the setup, but anyway, this is pharaonic. Red and white is the uh, United Kingdom of Pharaoh, like the Swiss colors, and blue is the color of the war. So there's the castle. Let's have a look. And another big French flag it's, uh, because of the uh, the terrorist attacks. These people are all ready to do it. To put them in the concentration camps. Horrible. Oui, je te disais que j'ai perdu un collègue pisciculteur dans l'attentat de Nice. Pisciculteur à, euh, originaire de Roquebillière, dans la vallée de la Vézébie. C'est où ça À une heure de Nice, au nord de Nice, dans la vallée de la Vézébie. C'était quoi son nom Il s'appelait David Bonnet. David comment Bonnet. Bonnet Oui, David ouais. Bonnet. 40, so, 44 ans. Yeah, so this guy is telling me he's uh, from the south, uh, the northeast of France. He's doing, um, uh, he's in the fish industry, um, having fish, you know, and selling it, you know. And he lost a, a friend of him, he was 44 years old, uh, David Bonnet, uh, during the, uh, the terrorist attack uh, in Nice on July the 14, 2016. So people really died there. It's, it's, it's bollocks to say nobody died, you know. I'm meeting people here in France all the time who know anybody, somebody who died. And this guy was willing to say, okay, I know somebody who died. And I was hitchhiking there the whole day. And at nine o'clock in the evening, a South African, he took me uh, hitchhiking to Napoli. But he left me in Albenga because I was going to the Liguria. And one hour later, there was the, the terrorist attack. And on the day, I saw a whole lot of cops on the uh, at the petrol station Le, Le Breguier in Nice so there was a an exercise of the police that day every time like September the 11th that was yesterday actually September the 11th 7-7 in London in Paris on uh, Friday the 13th Breivik in Norway every time there is a police exercise and I I did film them because I was so tired and I didn't have a place to upload it anyway. So this guy affirms it again. I'm, I haven't been meeting a lot of people who died in, like in Paris and... Uh, okay, to the au revoir. Au revoir. So this is the mayor's office and the cops are here as well, you know, it says. And it says uh, reinforce, you know, um, security against uh, terrorism. Yeah, <laughs> they only protect themselves. Yeah, look, there's a camera here. Hello, smile. There's another one there. Yeah, they, 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 they got it all. They got all secured all around it. You know, where is it? Ah, uh, oh, there it is. And of course, the church is next to them as always. You know, there's one bunch. And there's the uh, the lions, the symbol of the aristocracy. Well, it's them, it's Pharaoh. Look at these things here. And this is the Horus Matrix. That's that's us. And they raped our women, and they are uh, they, they got all the pharaonic genetics now. They only protect themselves, you know. And uh, the situation is quite tense here in France. There's a uh, it's a civil war coming up. Yeah. Cheers, mate. So there's the lion, the symbol of the aristocracy, on the, uh, it's quite hidden, you know, on the, uh, and that's the, uh, the city council, the mayor's office. And this is, you know, like considered the, uh, 
There they got they got some enormous cameras all over. Oh, there's one here. It's just like turning around here. It's a camera, you know. Probably a. Uh, oh, oh, it's looking at me. <laughs> Look at it just turned. Yeah. This is this can be considered like their castle. You know, this is why they're all gonna gather. You know, when it's all going, the hell's gonna break loose. And they're defended. There are nine water fountains for Isis and there are nine gods of the pharaohs, you know, the nine sisters of Isis. That's probably the most dangerous uh, uh, Freemason lodge in the entire world. And it's all being protected by the line and all sort of, you know, Isis being here. You know, so they all protect themselves very well. The authorities, the pharaohs, the aristocracies. And this is their castle. This is the new castle where they rule, city council.